No one gets hurt. Go! Open the door! They'll get worse than her! Hey! Hey! Ah, come on! Ah, finally! Don't do any crap! Let's go! Shut up! Shut the fuck up! Come on! In the back! Come on! Come on! Hands behind your back! Come on, Nestor! We're giving you everything you want! Don't even think about it! I'll do it! I'll do it! Okay. Get in there! Sit tight! I'll handle the blasting! Don't blow yourself up! Pay attention! Hurry! What's Em, he doing? get these assholes in the closet! Tell us in here! Leave us alone! You! We didn't do shit In the back! You. Come on! All set! Phone it in! I'm making the call! <laughs> All right, you gonna do this? Huh? <laughs> Show me the money! Slow and steady, T. Slow and steady. <coughs> oh! There it is! Here for us all to enjoy. Depends on how you look at it. We gotta move. Come on out, me. Give it up. Ah. I got him. Ah. I saw your face. I'll remember you. you can get a thousand things every day. How about you make sure this is one of them? I've seen his eyes. He's crazy. It'll be quick. Problem. Fuck! You didn't have to do that! Let's get going! There'll be time for grieving later! Yeah, you got that right. Move! I'm sending the charges! They're on a timer! So break yourself! Shutter switch. What's this? Local resistance? It ain't supposed to go down like this. It never is. Come on, go! Who snitch? You want to look at the face of death? Be my guest. Get out of the way or suffer the consequence. We keep going forward. What the fuck is this? Wrong profession! Press forward! Move! We're coming through! You... You shouldn't have been a cop! Dumb fucking cops! Drop it, prick! Jesus! Let's move! Come on! They answered the wrong call! This is fucked, man! The thing is full! I got my share of Cars up here! Let's go! Move! Come on! The kid might have bailed! This wasn't in the job description! Get in their faces! Don't be an idiot! Let's go! Get to the car! We got a window! Let's go! Every man for himself! Here and here! Hey, what took you so long? Shut the fuck up! And drive! Woo! Did you see that shit? Fucking put that bitch's face against the glass. Did you see that? Yeah, you're <laughs> real stout. <laughs>
train. We're getting there. Cops, coming our way. Be cool. They ain't made this car yet. Man, I'll believe in this bird when I get eyes on it. Shit, 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 roadblock. Go right. Beat the train, man. You guys all right? Fuck! Come on! Ditch the car, all right? We can go this way to the chopper. No! Hey! Stick to the plan! What? Stick to the fucking plan! Come on! Where the fuck's the chopper? Fuck. Someone must have fucking talked! All right, Brad's gonna be fine. We gotta get this fuck out of here! Out of here! Oh, Jesus! T, you gotta get out of here! I can't leave you, Mikey! No! God, I'm not gonna be fucking gonna bleed out! Go! No! Die, you cocksuckers! Kill me, you pricks! Motherfuckers! Ooh. You fucking cocksuckers! Ooh. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Not always a good husband. <laughs> not always a good citizen. He did not die a hero's death. But he was a man. Our Lord was crucified with two thieves. So perhaps we should not judge. We are born of sin and we die in sin. And in this, Michael. Father, we do not know your infinite mysteries, but we know that you will show mercy to our friends. Your son, James. He's a good kid. He's a good kid? A, a good kid? Why? Does he help the fucking poor? No. He sits on his ass all day, smoking dope and jerking off while he plays that fucking game. If that's our standard for goodness, then no wonder this country's screwed. And what about you? What about me? Hey. I don't have the advantages that kid has. By the time I was his age, I'd already been in prison twice. I robbed banks. I ran whores. I smuggled dope. And you consider them achievements? These were the opportunities I had. At least I took them. And where did these opportunities get you, Michael? They got me right fucking here. The end of the road with a big house and a useless kid, and I'm stuck talking to you because no one else gives a shit. Oh, I'm living a dream, baby. And that dream is fucked. It is fucking fucked. Let it all out. I think I just did. Oh, well, I 
think that's all we have time for. Same time next week? I guess. Oh. I gotta tell you, I ain't too sure this shit is working for me. Hmm. Well, a sense of overriding futility is a vital part of the process. Embrace it. Whatever you say, Doc. Gotta be around here somewhere. Unless they buried it under the sand, fool. Another Bray and Lamar Davis production. Man, fuck you. Hey, excuse me, homie. Can you tell me where Berto Beach House is? No, homie, I cannot. Man, would you come on? Fuck. Actually, yeah. It's that house right there with the yellow stairs. Yeah. Good looking out, homie. Appreciate it. Man, get your stupid ass on. Damn. Why don't you ask him if he knows the fucking owner? Or better yet, do some skywriting that reads there's a couple niggas here about to boost some cars in case somebody didn't realize. See, what you don't realize is we ain't boosting. This shit is legit business. Legit? Oh, yeah, I forgot, huh? 401ks, tax returns and all. Yeah, right. You the one all pumped up on doing this lick, nigga. I'm getting my money in the hood. I'm straight, fool. I'm cool. You cool? Cool what? Slanging dope and throwing up gang signs? Yeah, right. Whatever, homie. Yeah, homie, this the spin knot right here. Your boy Simeon wasn't bullshit. Man, get your ass in me. Hey, bring your ass, fool. Always trying to boss somebody. Come on. Come on. Shit, come on. Damn, this nigga must got the baby dick. <laughs> yeah, and all this shit paid for with bad credit. <laughs> come to daddy. Which one you want, nigga? Like that? Bobby Big Dick on a nigga, huh? Shit, for real, homie. Damn, this motherfucker got robo roof and everything, nigga. He should have paid the Nizzo. <laughs> Man, you got to grind to keep that shit. Now it's back on us. Hell yeah, I want to see what it do. Hey, hit me on the speaker phone, dog. Most like that? For sure, homie. JB's tow truck, it ain't got glamour, but it's some money to be made. So him and Tanya can smoke crack in peace? Homie, oh, homie. Good. Keep busting, huh? Whatever, homie. Woo! You wanna get whips like this? You gotta stay on your grid now. Nigga ain't do some time over nickels and dimes? I stick to repos, dawg. Hang him right there. All right. I commit you from the shoulders, homie. Let's show these movie people how we roll. I guess you gotta get ready for something. What the fuck? Oh, we feel this shit here, huh? Hey, hey, down this alley here. Yeah, that's cool. <laughs> Remember, this is your Terrier's car. If you want to chunk them things. Left here. Fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
here. Hey, open up, homie. Give me some room. You want room? Go lose some weight with your fat ass. Oh, shit! Dog, move over so the traffic can flow through. Whatever, nigga. I'll let something flow through your ass. Dog, I ain't too sure that joke works, dog. Oh, shit. Oh, shit, the one time. Be cool, fool. We got the paperwork. Whatever, you explain that shit. I'll see you at the dealership. Explain that shit, my ass. I don't get you, bro. You are a racist, and I don't like you. And I will not sell you this car. I will not. You make my skin crawl, you neo-Nazi. Hey, you are all the same. You're disgusting. This racist insulted me. Hey, what's up, bro? Who are you calling a nigger? No, no, I'm not calling nobody a nigger. Wait, what the fuck? I, I mean, N-word. I, I, that, that's not cool, man. I, I don't say that. You fucking right, and you better keep it right, because this man right here, He's an international businessman, a multiculturalist. That I could not have said better myself. Ah. But seriously, maybe he's not a racist. But I don't think that he is man enough for a car like this. Wait, wait a second. <laughs> this guy right here, him? Get him a hybrid. That's a real man's car. <laughs> <laughs> I think you are right, Lamar. You get a tax rebate. I understand. Money is an issue, eh? Money isn't an issue. This is the best car. Watch this when he real and mean. He gonna get all this full money. Watch this. Look, man, I gotta go. <laughs> hey, Simeon, I'm out. I holler at you, homie. <laughs> it's the best part, man. So, Jimmy, are you sure you are man enough? Take the wheel and show me. Uh, sure, okay. How about we fall through, homie? I'm gonna knock a bad, grown and sexy bitch if I ain't got a fat peas eye. Who you trying to impress? Your auntie Denise with all that ass, nigga. She got ass. She grown, yeah. She grown into a fucking idiot. No, she's sexy. Sexy? She more like obsessed with sex, nigga. Nah, no, mad for the penis. That's exactly how I like my women. Burgers 
next week. Man, shit, it's good to be home. What's up? Can a low come up in your crib? Man, fuck you. I'll see you at work. Oh, nigga, don't hate me because I'm beautiful, nigga. Maybe you got rid of that old yee-yee-ass haircut you got, you get some bitches on your dick. Oh, better yet, maybe Tanisha will call your dog ass if she ever stop fucking with that brain surgeon the lawyer she fucking with, nigga. What? Oh, motherfucker. Ooh, honey. <laughs> Y'all telling me? Oh, he here. We living on top of each and other, and it ain't right. Shoo! Shoo! Get on out of here! America, okay, baby. I see you at the thing. So you here? You don't have to. I was on the phone, boy. Don't be listening. Goddamn freeloader. Los Santos Affordable Homes and Redwood Tobacco. Before we start this week's episode of Morehead Rides Again, we'd like to tell you about a remarkable free offer. You can own an incredible, genuine Gordon Morehead detective badge, replica gun, and packet of candy cigarettes. So you can help protect your neighborhood the same way Gordon protects America. All you need to do is get your dad or uncle to write a check for $10. Franklin! Hey, what's going down, huh? The market, my boy. Liquidity's a bitch. Get over here so I can give you the new repo list. All right, dog. I'll be around when I get a chance. Hey. Hey, what's up, Simeon? My dear boy, so good to see you. So good. Hold me. <laughs> yeah, look, man. Look, we've been working together for about a few months now, right? Which is why I am very honored to announce to you that you are employee of the month. Huh? Anyway, congratulations. It wasn't easy picking a winner. <laughs> yeah, me, Lamar, your nephew Sacha with the Twitch. Look, man, it's been a real honor, homie. But I gotta move forward in my life. It seems like all I do is let people tell me what to do and I do it and nothing changes. I tell you what, my boy. You tell me exactly what you want and I will very carefully explain to you why it cannot be. What? Today is repossessing vehicles that fools have purchased at exorbitant interest rates. But tomorrow, together, I never had a black son. But if I did, I want him to be just like you. Knock, knock, ah. niggas. Ah. <laughs> Hello, What's up, Lamar. Sydney? What's up, homie? What's up, then, homie? What's up, dog? Franklin here has been awarded Employee of the Month. You fucking with me, right? Man, we both being fucked with, dog. Man, knock it off, man. For real, after all the motherfucking work I put in, man. Man, fuck this Employee of the Month shit, homie. I'm sitting up here trying what to get What you mean, us... fuck this employee of the month shit, man? When it's some shit to be won, goddammit, I want it. I don't give a fuck what it is. You know what I'm talking about? I take no prisoners. I go hard doing this shit. Big dog, big nuts. When names is on the motherfucking board, I want to see my name at the top of that motherfucker next to it. It needs to say, winner. <laughs> hey, maybe next month, huh? Man, fuck next month, Simeon. What about today? I, I demand a retrial. Today is nothing. Just a bike. Hasn't made a payment at all. Some kid at Vespucci Beach. His name is Esteban Jimenez. Is he in a gang? Curiously enough, I did not inquire when he bought the bike. <laughs> we got work to do, uh, employee of the month. Man, fuck you and come on. Man, he's about a yes mouse ass nigga. What we waiting for? Magellan Ave, nigga. Best Beauty Beach. 
And you still rolling with that old raggedy ass here? That country bumpkin shit is enough to get us shot right there. I never took you to be old hairstylist type bitch, but now it's all starting to make sense. Hey, wasn't that motherfucker who took the bike that S.A. Vagos dude with the tattoo on his face and shit? Yeah, that was him. Fuck, homie. I don't want no unnecessary bullshit here, all right? Nigga, I don't give a shit. There's a reason Simeon pays a couple of mean-looking motherfuckers to come repo this shit. We ain't Girl Scouts. In your case, I ain't so sure about that. Man, step up, nigga. Of course this dude real. Who else gonna have to require a surplus of paper and deficiency of brain cells? He just put a dub down on this bike. 20 G's? With a 3G note? Damn, that motherfucker must be tricked out, dawg. Man, this whole setup designed to take drug money. All right, man, look, we go in quiet. In and out, no fucking drama. I'll try, homie, but I'm one loud, dramatic, brass, crazy, greedy, shooting motherfucker in the back type motherfucker. And you love me for it, nigga. <laughs> yeah, that's right, homie. Nothing but love, nigga. I'd send me a funny dude, though. Uh, it's gonna be a shame when we get to book his ass and jack him for all this shit. What the fuck you talking about? You're a psychotic motherfucker. That's how shit work, ain't it? You do some jobs for a fool, develop a little uneasy relationship, and then they ask you to do something above and beyond. You fall out, fools get capped, and then you start all over again with some other fool. Where the fuck you get that from? That ain't my life, dummy. How about the boy with the eye from around the way? Marcus or something, you were slanging for him, and then he got what was coming, right? That was different. That dude had it coming. I don't want to clap my boy Terry in either. I like homie. It's just smacks of the inevitable. Look, dawg, this time we legit, homie. This honest work is going to end up with us coming up in the world. Oh, really? That's a nice change from fools coming up on us. That's trill, homie. You damn straight that's trill, partner. But it's a shame I don't believe it. You want to drop some notes on that shit? I'll give you the eyes, homie. You Apache motherfuckers love y'all best, huh? You should go work on one of them reservation casinos. Only they'll kick your ass off for being a fraudulent imposter, motherfucker. You and all your little racial stereotypes and shit, I find them offensive. I'm very sensitive to your intolerance, my nigga. Whoa, 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 whoa. It's okay. We're cool. The bike should be in one of the lockups down here. Should be is the story of your life, asshole. You gave me fucking harpies. Repeat after me. I think this crazy motherfucker wants something. Hey, what's up, homie? You all right? No, wait, wait! Wait, Rabbi! We're from Sapo Agents! Uh. Yeah, you thought I was gonna hit your bitch ass, huh? Drunk ass nigga. Be cool, nigga. Yeah, that's right. Keep it moving, bitch. Man, I don't like this shit one bit. Hey, look, let's keep it smooth, homie. Man, your pussy the only thing that's smooth up in this shit. Man, what exactly did I do in the past life to deserve your stupid ass? This is a routine lick, dawg. Chill. Do them Vagos look routine? This is a shady-ass alley. Shit, we in Vespucci Beach. We on the wrong side of Vespucci Beach. You should know a block makes a difference. Hey, 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 hold up. Got to be in one of these motherfuckers. Man, ain't this about a bitch. Ain't no motherfucking bike in here, man. No shit, nigga. Hola, amigos. Hola, S.A. Oh, we saw you trying to creep up in here, man. Yeah? You saw this motherfucker? Oh, shit. Yo, yo. Oh, shit! Oh, oh, oh. Vamos! Fucker. Fucking die. Hey, come on down, everybody. Come on down. Hey, nigga, I would've just got my ass beat over a fucking gunfight. Man, stop being a pussy, nigga, and grab that heat. I will blast them oh, Fuck, they must have heard some down. shit. Shit, on your left. Find your bitch ass and cover. Find cover, amigo. Homie, get out. Viva los chapines! Somebody help him! We trapped down the alley! Hey, get in cover over there by the truck! Follow me! Get through it! Somebody tell them niggas it's illegal repossession! Flipping bricks is easier work, dawg! Get the floor, You got beat with an ugly stick! There's the fool on the balcony! Up there, shoot that nigga! Bust his ass! Check that door! They trying to mash on us! Oh, fuck! Damn! Get that car they trying to get out of here! Swore the nigga! Shoot the gas, homie! Oh, you deadly motherfucker! You still breathing, homie? 
Yeah, barely, homie. Shit, we gotta get... Man, we only came here for a bite. And that motherfucker is right there. Hey, nigga, come here. We got your pink slip. Let's get it. Man, this is fucking crazy. with an L, we massacred those motherfuckers. Man, I can't hang with your ass for a while, bro. You a psychopath. You done finally fucking lost it. Nigga, that's that Apache blood in me, homie. You ain't lucky I ain't do a flying tomahawk and scalp they motherfucking ass. We can't repo the assets of a dead man, big sitting chief asshole. Nigga, and we ain't going to neither, nigga. I'm gonna keep this motherfucker for myself. Tell Simeon we couldn't recover. You fucking tell him, you fucking moron! You, Tanya? Ain't nothing wrong with me, nigga. Shit. Well, your ass don't look too good. Where the fuck is JB? Smoking. And what about you? I mean, you know, I quit. You know what I'm saying? Almost. Yeah, whatever. JB, look, JB gonna lose everything. He gonna lose the house. You know what I'm saying? The business, everything. And you his cousin, nigga. You said you was gonna he help. He ain't my cousin. Whatever, if that's how you feel. What the fuck do I know about towing cars? Look, it's easy. If JB can do it, you can do it for fuck's sake. Come on, I'm gonna show you. Come on, shit. All right, then. Shit. She win everything. Hey, look, let's make this quick. I got shit to do. Nigga, you need to slow it down. Tanisha was right. All right, shit, where we going? Trucks at the Davis Sheriff Impound. Oh, man, how did I get dragged into this? We both know you always been sweet on me. <laughs> Shit, Franklin Clinton. Shit, your ass must be high or something. I told you, I don't do that shit no more. I mean, I baby doze now and again just for the taste. But I'm doing good, boo. Your eyes don't lie. Whatever you say, girl. Come on. There's JB's truck. Let's go bring the cha-ching, homie. Yo, we on that like ugly on your like ugly on your mama. Ten nine, come again? I didn't catch that. It's Tanya, fool, and my boy Franklin. We filling in for JB. Uh, copy that. Uh, hi, Tanya. Car's a junker. Been there for days. Ten seven. I'm gone. A bucket. This 
This one should be easy. Shit, not easy enough for JB to drag his ass out of whatever crack house he laying in. His loss, your gain, sugar. It's Except I ain't gaining shit, sugar. Move that seat back, and you know I'll make it right for you. That ain't what I'm saying. Damn, Tiny, what the fuck happened to you? Okay, I've seen JB do this a hundred times. Back up close. Make sure the hook is down, and it should slide right in. Hey, baby, back it up nice and steady. Okay, we are in, baby. Let's get this back to the lot. Hey, this was not how I saw my day going. So I ain't seen you around the hood much? I've been trying to branch out. Can't stay in Chamberlain Hills forever. Oh, nigga got airs now. I remember you before you was a wannabe when you just was. And I remember you and JB before y'all was dopey. Shit changed. You the one all turfed up. JB smoking, but he ain't smoking homies. Jesus. He ain't smoking homies. He out here grinding, towing cars, paying bills. For real. Because I could have sworn it was me out here towing cars for him. And looking damn fine doing it too, baby. Okay, we make the drop where they got the areas marked. They get real finicky when we don't leave it in the right place. All right, sugar, you can unhook it now. I'll see you on the block. Anything you need, you holler at me. Now, where is that fool? You're a racist. What? What? You don't like me because you think that I am an Arab. What? No. What are you talking about? Excuse like me. That, wait. that oh, wait, boy. I, I... I am his mentor. I am so proud of you. What do you mean, a mentor? Don't worry about that. Okay, so what you got for him? James De Santa. Some kid. He is already late on his payments, and I have this bad feeling that he will do more damage to the car than we can get back from him in the exorbitant interest rate payments. Huh? Just go and get it. The house is on um, uh, Hampstead uh, off Eclipse. It's an SUV. Huh? Some Rockford Hills daddy's boy nonsense. Don't worry about it. Try to bring the car back in good condition, huh? Gotcha. Don't worry about it. It's so good to see you, my boy. Hey, good luck in uh, law school, huh? So, Mr. Kenneth, were we at uh, financing? Hey, did you change your mind? When I discover that you betray me, perhaps. I hear you took the bike for yourself, my employee of the month. Listen, man, me and Lamar was gonna get that back to you, dog. Oh, I am sure. You will get this car off the daddy's boy, and then we talk. Insurance papers say they have a locked garage, so you'll need to gain access from inside the house. Man, it's never easy with you, is it, Simi? Do not talk to me about easy, you thief. Oh, 
It's just because you have a massive gaper, bitch. Fucking homo, you're dead. Dead! He said I had a massive... Bitch! He tried to knife attack me. Oh my god, seriously? My brother is such a homer. I think he has a medical problem. Like, more medical problems than the ones he's already been diagnosed with. <laughs> Mental ones? Seriously, penises are not meant to be that small. I fucking know, right? I've seen enough of them. <laughs> it's probably because he's so fat. I still love him, though. Sort of. <laughs> Dead, you fucking idiot! And interesting is just the you know, guys don't they just don't get you. Hello? Hello? Fuck. Thank you, coach. You're a real pro, Mrs. DeSanta. A real pro. Well, you're a great student. Now just loosen up those hips. Okay, like this? Yeah, loosen them up. There you go. And follow through. Perfect. Oh, okay. I think I'm getting it. Hey, Simeon, I got the ride, man. I'm coming back. Yeah, if you actually bring the repossession to me this time, I can have it back out on the street before the day is done. That's a 9mm semi-automatic pushed against your skull. Huh? Now look around. You just keep driving where you're going. Hey, come on, man. This was a repo job. Guy was behind on his fucking note. Unlikely. Considering my son just got the car. And looking at the way you're going about this, my guess, you're working a credit fraud. A credit fraud? Be serious. Don't cry at you. A credit fraud? Be serious, dude. I just worked a fucking repo. I appreciate a kid who follows orders without taking responsibility. Yeah, maybe one day we'll have a beer, and I'll explain how the world really works. Who gives you the slip? A car dealer, dawg, by the name of Simeon Terry. So this businessman, he look legit to you? Look, man, it's just between him and your fucking son. Don't worry. Me and Mr. Yatarian, we'll work this out. Jess up here. Okay. Stop the car. Pull up. That the place? Yeah, this the place, man. Whoa. Drive into it. Right through the fucking window. And fast. Or I'll put two rounds in the back of your skull and do it myself. Man, you can't be for real. I look like a fucking joke to you. Man, fuck my life, man. Fuck it. I still got this gun to your head. Damn! Franklin! What the fuck are you doing? Mr. Samuel, it's not exactly how it looks. I always trump big for a job well done. Now get out of here, kid. You motherfucker! I won't be treated like this! Ah! <clears throat> How dumb are you? You're fucking mental! <coughs> what 
What is wrong with you? You recognize this car? Huh? Does it look like it's worth five grand a month to you? You fucking racist! I'll tell you something. This thing's gonna need some serious body work for it's worth five grand a month. Ah, <laughs> he agreed to financing. I have his signature. Yeah, did he agree to have some punk break into my fucking house? I, I don't know. I, uh... That kid might be a fucking idiot, but you are a fraudulent scumbag piece of shit. Ugh. Don't make me have to come back here. Say again? How the fuck we get fired? Man, it was partly all that bullshit you pulled, and partly the repos old man making me crash the car into the dealership. Ha! <laughs> you crazy ass motherfucker in this partnership. You better spin them while you got them. Yeah, if you say so. Hey, don't make me commit a 187, ho. Some kind of big joke? It doesn't matter what the clothing looks like. We're selling an attitude. What's the attitude? Will you fuck off? What do you want? Man, I come by for that drink you offered, that's all. I wasn't really serious about that. What? Uh, you're here, whatever. Sit. You're not gonna rob me again. Man, I never robbed you. That was just a repossession. <laughs> okay. You call it whatever you want to call it. I really don't care. What can I do for you? Shit, I just came by to see if there's something I can help you with. I see you doing well for yourself. Look, I'm retired. Ain't you a bit young for the pipe, slippers, and staring at a fucking sunset? You know, I've been in this game for a lot of years, and I got out alive. That makes me the right age. <clears throat> you look like a good kid. But if you want my advice, you give the shit up. You work hard, screw over everybody that you love. Hurt, rob, kill indiscriminately, and maybe, just maybe, if you're lucky, you become a three-bit gangster. It's bullshit. 
Go to college. Then you can rip people off and get paid for it. It's called capitalism. Hmm. So what I saw the other day was like when a corpse briefly reanimates itself and terrorizes everyone, right? What you saw the other day was a guy dealing with pests. I guess I never saw myself as just a fucking pest. Well, and today's lesson's all about humility. Tomorrow we'll try a training montage. A training what? Nothing. I was just lost in an 80s movie fantasy. <laughs> yeah, I can see you spend a lot of time there. Yeah, as much as I can. So that's why you're here in Vinewood then, right? Maybe I'm here because I'm just an idiot. Who thinks that imported palm trees are a good substitute for not really knowing what the fuck you're doing on this earth. Jesus, man. You a good time, you know that. I tell you what. <sighs> Least I can do is buy you that beer. There's a little bar I like. <sighs> it's not too far from here. Let's go. Alright, man. I'm following you. <sighs> Let's take Amanda's car. Hey, Jim. I'm going for a drink. Dad, man. shit! I mean, our boat going down the Western Highway. It's... it's been stolen. What? The yacht's been stolen? I, I was trying to sell it. I know you didn't want it sold, but I need money, and they don't want to buy it. They just want to take it. I'm hiding in the head. You're insane! All right, I'm coming. For my boat. All righty, then. Change of plans. My darling boy is in trouble. Hey, I'll help you out. Lesson number one, don't ever have kids. Hey, man, look, if I had kids, I don't think no parenting issues would arise over who had boat privileges and who don't. Shit, motherfuckers would be lucky to sit in a bathtub. Shit, things that desperate, huh? Nah, but, you know, shit, I was making a point. Mythologizing self-deprecation. I know it well. Yeah, man, but shit, where the boat at? Little shit's been hijacked. They're somewhere on the Western Highway. Man, ain't you worried? About my boat? Yeah, I am. But you can always buy another boat. Yeah, tell my accountant that. Man, you can always get credit for one. But have you come repo it? No, thank you. <laughs> All right, homie. I ain't your homie. I'm someone you want to impress. Really? Man, I thought you was retired. Why the fuck do I want to impress some slipper-wearing motherfucker? Because I can still teach you a thing or two. Maybe help you open the door to all the joys that boat-related parenting issues entail. Oh! There! There, there it is! That's my boat! Your boat's in a fucking hurry, man! Yeah, well, we'll catch him. Come on, kid! Dad! Don't dad be, you little shit! You 
better hope she's still seaworthy! Shop back there, dog. The driver's there. We can get the ride fixed. My fault. It's just a thing. My fault. Please stop doing that. Listen, I fucked up, okay? I'm not going to lie. That was a really bad judgment call. But shit, Dad, I nearly died. And all you give us here about is this fucking boat. No. Not that. All we do is scream at each other. No wonder I can't get a job. It's all your fucking fault. Or it's not, but it's partly your fault. I, I mean, I just want to impress you. By selling my boat to some gangbangers? I know it sounds dumb when you put it like that, but all you do is daydream or get angry. Look, I love you, Jimmy, but you're an asshole. And right now, with my boat disappearing over the horizon, that's all I can see. Franklin, do you do me a favor and get this kid a ride home after you fix this thing? I want to headbutt the road in peace. Oh, great! Leave me with the home invader! I'll get it done, dog. No problem. Dad! Enough! All right? Enough! Hey, Franklin, can you call me a cab? Sure thing, man. Up there, uh, go left. Hey! I need a cab as soon as you can send one. Los Santos Customs, by the airport. All right, thanks. Thanks, man. Hey, so you uh do much yachting? Not anymore. No, I don't. Before, I mean, man. No, no, not really. This little shit stays in his room all day, and I don't have any other people to go with, you know? I like looking at it. Looking? Yeah. You know, I come down to the marina, sit on the dock, pour myself a drink, and look at her. Hey, this the place up here. I know this dude, man. His name Howard. He gonna look after me. All right, take what's in my pocket. A couple thousand bucks. That'll cover it, right? Yeah, it should be cool. Good. So you sure you're good? Yeah, I got this. All right. Ooh, uh, I'm gonna come up front. Get out and walk around. It's okay, I can just climb over. Look, man, I'm gonna get the ride fixed, man. They dropped it back off at your house along with this dude. It's all good, though, man. You gonna get your head right, all right? All right, listen, thanks for today. I appreciate it. You stop back out to the house, we'll talk. Ugh, you see? So, man. Hey, sorry we didn't get your boat, man. Yeah. Come on, man. Let's trick this whip, homie. Come on, man. Let's get in there. Still need to get you out for one of the races, Franklin. See if you drive as fast as you talk. All right, good as new. So, uh, what do you think? You know, you can. All right, man, I'm taking you home. It's Franklin, right? Yeah, Franklin. All the credit for our guy, the home invader. You know what? Call me what you like, man. Yeah. I, I, no, I, I mean, sure. Jimmy, ain't it? Or James? Jimmy? Or just like, Jizzle? <laughs> no, man, I'll just stick with Jimmy, homie. So, uh, what's the deal, man? Huh? You and my old man? I see you at the dealership, then someone steals my whip, and Papa's all like, he's been down there to talk to you guys. Your pops did more than talk. What'd he do? Look, man, if he ain't tell you, I ain't gonna tell you. But I lost my fucking job, and I thought maybe he could help me find a new one. 
Dude, my dad is retired. Like, fully? Like, his only marketable skills are watching TV and daytime drinking. Man, look, I don't know, homie. He seems okay to me. Shit, he saved your ass. You saved my ass. Nah, nah, man. Well, well, maybe we good together, you know? Like, maybe we can get shit done we couldn't do separate. If it keeps him out of the house, that's cool by me. Yeah, well, we'll see. Look, I'm sorry my dad lost to your job. It's hard out there. What the fuck? It's hard out there. Huh, I mean, I'm employmentally challenged at the moment. Oh, you got fired, dude. Damn, that's rough. I'm not fired as such. I didn't get a job. I've been there, homie. You've been putting them resumes out there, but no one's hiring, huh? No, I, uh, I didn't get a job. I've never had a job. It feels like hard work. Life, the days just kind of disappear. Hey, you play Righteous Slaughter? Nah, not since the first couple. Okay. Yo, so like, since we're both unemployed, like, we could run together, you know? Yeah, I think about it, homie. Or, or we could just like, shop it, you know? Play darts or get our drink on? Strip clubs? Come on, dude, I get real crazy. Yeah, I got your number, shit, I need it, man, but uh... Hey, hey you know what? Man, go easy on your pops, dog. all right? All right, church. <laughs> exactly, man. My brother from another mother. I mean... I, I hope so, because my mom was kind of a skank back in the day. See ya. Yeah, whatever, homie. Peace. Hey, look, man. Look! You were like a son to me. Employee of the month. Does that mean nothing to you? Man, the dude had a gun in my head. No loyalty, no integrity. You should have taken the bullet. My business, my totally legitimate business. You are fucked, my boy. Fucked. But you know what? It's getting to be a bit much. I have no idea how you cope. Of course I cope. I'm a woman. <laughs> Ain't that the truth? <laughs> but girl, I done done all that I can do. But you know how boys are. Wait a minute. Oh, girl. Oh, hey, how much further? We ain't even gone five yards yet. Okay. I know. I'm just asking. This is spirit walking. Exercises body and soul. It's all the rage. We are women we and are we women. are free. Free and free. We are women. Here we are free. We are women. Here I shout. We are women. Tell us how. We are women and we Damn. Are F, is that your auntie? Yeah, thank God I missed her crazy ass. She's spirit walking this shit now, man. That's just her attempts to. Hey, hey, don't be talking shit about your auntie, man. She got. I mean, she cool as a motherfucker, man. Come on. Come where? We gotta go pick up some shit from around the corner, man. We can walk and talk at the same time, my nigga. Why the fuck we can't drive? Around the block with Chop? You need to walk with your fat ass. <sighs> yeah, okay, you tall, linky son of a bitch. Come on, homie, we ain't got all day. Let's go. For sure, but what you got up? 
kidnapping, fool. That clown D. That OG fool from Ball. Dog, I told you, no more game banging retro vengeance yeah, bullshit. I'm trying to make some fucking paper. You gonna make some paper, low? And ain't nobody out here gang banging. It just look like that. You gotta know the difference, man. Fuck, man, great. My aunt would be very happy, homie. She wants me dead anyway, so she can get the fucking house. You got the wheel, homie. Get in the van, chop. Get in the van. Good dog. We going up Vinewood Boulevard. Hey, I like your dog, homie. Me and Chop got a lot in common. Your annoying ass. Man, I'm carrying both of y'all asses, homie. Look what I set up. Man, fuck this, man. You seen Tanisha? She's straight. It's me and you that ain't straight, though, homie. Dog, I know, homie. But look, I met this contact, this white dude. Real serious dude, man. This motherfucker know the streets, homie. I know he'll be a good hookup for us. We don't need no hookup, fool. I know these streets. You know these streets. Man, all you know is dime bag hustling, credit card stealing. Boosting gas tankers on me? Come on, man. What, you trying to be some fucking commodity trader or something? Fool, that shit went up, man. Look, homie, I don't mind dying, you feel me? But I just want to die for something that matters, homie. That's what foreign gangsters should really be about. And I know this much, the motherfucking OGs ain't even giving a fuck about us, though. Man, fuck the OGs, then. You know what I'm saying? This ain't no motherfucking pyramid scheme. No, wait, hold on. Listen to your boy one time. Listen to your boy. You want some paper, my nigga? This is what it's about. Check it out. I'm talking about 40. Thousand. No problem. Cash in hand, two days time, no killing, nothing. No, just starting another beef with the fucking ballers, nigga. That's class A felony bullshit. We gonna keep our disguise on. Ain't nobody gotta know it was us. <laughs> yeah, whatever, homie. We'll see about that. <laughs> he down his alley up here. Hey, what's up, boo? Ain't you little Laida's cousin? Yeah. Damn, you short witty. I was just saying, I was trying to and holler at you. You ain't hollering at nothing over here. Why has it gotta be like that? I'm an OG. And OG, so what? So the fuck what, nigga? It's a million OGs. Well, over shit, here. how about I put one of these little X pills up your ass crack? Next thing you know, you're gonna be begging for it, boo-boo. That's disgusting. What's happening now, D-Man? Ain't no fun if the gangsters can't have none. Man, fuck you, Mark. I ain't sharing no ass to CGF. Ain't nobody sharing nothing. Man, shut the hell up, fuck bitch. Fuck you, nigga. Man, fuck y'all. Hey, ain't there a law against you mark-ass gangsters insignia mask-wearing motherfuckers? Oh, so what's up now, nigga? You snitching or something, oh, nigga? Oh, shit. Bitch ass nigga. Fuck you, nigga. I'm out of here. Fuck y'all, bitch. That, Come on, let's go. Go, go, get in the van. <laughs> He on a bike, man. We ain't gonna catch him. Oh, gangster, we got this. It's gonna get bumpy, Chop. That's 40 G's getting away right there. Man, sorry about that. What the fuck you say something for? We could have creeped up on this nigga. You see yourself, Franklin? Nigga's a big black motherfucker. Nigga, your creeping days is over. Go back to chamber. Come on, homie, concentrate on the road! Hey, Apache Blood, you gonna be able to trace this nigga if he goes to the ground? I know your answers to taught you them Buffalo tracking scheme. Man, I ain't gonna perform for you like some Indian in the wild. West, yo, that's racist, bitch. Fucking full of shit. Here they get dumb. Man, look at this shit, dawg. We chasing another mother... Fuck on a motorcycle. Cut down here. Oh, shit. Damn. He got fucked up. Man, take time. Go get that fool. Man, you just sitting your ass there with your feet kicked up. Go on, Chop. Go, on. Go bite his ass. Get that motherfucker, Chop. Get him. You gonna pay for this? Ah! Jesus! Uh. Screw you! 
Chop, we gotta go. Lamar sure show ain't been training your ass, has he, boy? Come on, man, back to business. Get the bad guy. Come on, smell that stinky motherfucker. Your ass, come. You scared of dogs, nigga? Oh, shit! Screw that dog, man! Don't hump him! Bite his ass, chop! Get him! Oh, fuck you, you son of a bitch! Man. That bitch just fucking bit me, man! Shut the fuck up! Hey, man, get over here! Oh, shit! What the fuck, man? I ain't got no beef with the CTF! Cause maybe we doing our own thing! What the fuck, man? What the man? fuck the fan, punk? Shit! Hey, Lamar Davis, is that you, nigga? Nigga, shut the fuck up! Just get in! Yeah, that's you, nigga! Fucking oh, idiot! Shit. I said I had no beef, man! Shut up! Hey, up. man! What the Watch fuck? You, Get this fucking dog Come away from me! Come on! Fuck! Hey, if you don't try... Hey, Chop! He gonna be a lost cause like you, dawg! We gonna stash this dude in my spot! <laughs> We going back to your crib? I've been there when you was in diapers. Shut up, man. You ain't recognize me. I knew it was you before you took that flag off. You always been dumb, Lamar. Really? Well, I guess that means we gonna have to shoot your ass when you oh, pick up our damn. four stacks. You ain't gonna pick up shit. Fans gonna be on you before you can even move, nigga. Be quiet. I gotta make a call. We got to go. You calling them on a the cell phone, you dumb motherfucker? They gonna trace this shit in a second. We want 40,000. Just pay me or pay the funeral director, motherfucker. What the fuck you done done? You just gave them our location. Now we gotta let this motherfucker out of here. Watch out, man. Watch. Get the fuck out of here. And nigga, give me that damn phone. What the fuck? Fuck you up. 
I'll be seeing y'all soon. The only reason you've been seeing shit because we went easy on your ass. Remember that, dog. Oh, you owe me a bike, do you, motherfucker? This some bullshit. Right? Take me down the cut. Hey, yo! Man, what the fuck is wrong with you, nigga? I was getting us paid. What the fuck is wrong with you, nigga? That was a good phone. A good phone? The cops was all over, nigga. I could have swallowed my car and tried to triangulate that. It's too late. Shit's done. At least I saved you the indignity of pulling apart your shit. Nigga, I ain't afraid to get my hands dirty, old precious motherfucker. This is what I mean, homie. We need to get serious. Get paid. This shit ain't working. So your old white dude gonna fix us. Where my first class? Look, I'm gonna learn some skills, man. Pass them on. There's a whole city out there. It's waiting to be taken, nigga. You just give me the heads up when you over that shit. Ready to wipe old dude nut off your face, old lame-ass Mark. Man, fuck you, Lamar. All right, motherfucker. You the motherfucker. You better watch out for the bombs. They gonna be on you now. The cops gonna be on your ass, too. Yeah, I ain't worried about it. I'm a motherfucking gangster. You know how I do. I can take care of my sizzle. No, the fuck you kids ain't. Everything hurts. You know, or something where I could be like a superhero. Let's meet up next week. Man. Tracy. Yo. Amanda. Amanda. You better not be. Not in my house. Fuck you, Michael. Go away! I'm paying that turd 150 bucks an hour to fuck my wife in my own bed? Michael, go away! Oh, no, I'm sorry, bro. She said you had an arrangement. You and I are gonna have an arrangement. I'm gonna arrange your fucking funeral. I'm really sorry, bro. I'll cop the session. I promise. You are dead, man. Oh. Fuck. Dead! Come here! Ah! Fuck. Hey, you! Stop it! What's up, man? Get out of my way. Michael, calm down. What the fuck is going on? Nothing happened. It was a misunderstanding. She fucked a prick in my bed. You <laughs> bullshitting me. It wasn't like that. You in? Fuck it. I'm in. Let's roll. Let's get this motherfucker. Just don't kill him! You okay, homie? What happened? The guy bounced my wife is what happened. Which guy? The guy I'm paying to teach her tennis. Tennis coach? Oh, that's fucked up, man. Who is dudes, homie? You know, back in the hood, man, we gotta watch out for the mailman, dog. Yeah, I'm a cuckold, a snob, and a fucking cliche. He went left up there, dog. Man, I think we lost this thing. He lives somewhere up in the canyon. We'll find him. Where'd that slimy little white fucker go? Okay, this is the turn. Hey, you don't want to be fucking out. Yeah, keep your eye out. He left his car. Check it out. Little prick's up there. Look. Oh, 
Shit, Cole's doing all right for himself. Hey, asshole! You ran off before we could settle our debts! Michael, fuck! You got the wrong idea, man! He's about to have a real clear idea where I'm coming from. There's a winch in the back of the truck. Tied a cable to one of those supports up there. You finna pull his deck down? Hey, that prick pulled my marriage down. Man, you really gonna be this fucking dramatic? Yeah, whatever. I told you I comp the session, bud! Well, there were a lot of freaking sessions, bud! I'm thinking you were working on more than just her backhand. Mandy's backhand has come a long way, bro. But sometimes it's gotta get worse to get better. Yeah, well, maybe I should come up there and practice my backhand. On your face! Oh, bud, your negative energy is seriously bringing me down. Oh, I hope it is, bud. We hooked up, man. You come into my house, take my money, and nail my wife? Are you fucking kidding me? I'm gonna stick up my hand and say that was uncool, bud. Yeah. My bad. Seriously. Oh. How fucking magnanimous. May I please offer you my applause? You fucking motherfucker! Dude! And we'll see how you like it when someone fucks with your shit! Well, oh, hey! Wait! You got the wrong idea, pal! Whoa! Fuck! Here we go! <laughs> Let's see what happens! Dude, you are probably crazy! <laughs> oh, shit! Our damn sweating already! Oh, hell yeah, man. You know what time it is. Man, hold that drubbing outside tonight, dawg. Yeah, he gonna feel this, dawg. Are you fucking serious, nigga? Yeah! Fuck, come on! Fuck, man, fuck! Oh, we did it! Fuck his ass! Yeah, fuck him. But was we really trying to pull that dude house off the fucking hill? Hey, we were trying to teach him a fucking lesson. <laughs> now that's an expensive bitch-ass lesson, man. Maybe he'll keep it on the court and out of my wife. Yeah, he not taking no housewives back to that motherfucker. Hey, it's a service to the fucking community. Mr. DeSanta, what? What the hell? That's not my house! Bullshit. Oh, bro, I couldn't afford a place like that. I'm a tennis coach. I hit balls for a living. I was just hiding there. Help me afford! You! You're a dead one! Green light! Green light! Martin Madrazo, give you green light! Oh, I'm scared, lady. Just fucking terrified. Yeah. Green light! Green light! Fuck, Shit, we got some cameras on this, homie. You kidding me? Yeah, can you do something? And you get kind of reckless, homie. I'll try, man. Try. Come on, kid. all over the place, no but way. you were a help. Ah, uh, thanks. I guess. Hey, don't... Get the fence. Go to a shooting range. Work on your aim. You'll do fine. Oh, fuck, man. Shit, you good? Fine as wine. Got a few knocks. You okay? I mean, you did good, kid. Man, I'm cool, man. I mean, you. Mentally. Mentally? Oh, man. I'm fucking excellent. My heart ain't pumped like that in years. Oh, yes. Fucking A, Bubba. Man. You sound kind of manly. You just been greenlit by the Mexican underworld ambassador to Los Santos. Trust me, we handled it. Whoever the fuck Martin Madrazo is, I've known worse. We just handled a few low-ranking crimes. We sit on it, we see what happens. Kid, there's no use second-guessing. Felt good, man. Woo! Yeah! 
doing something for a change. <laughs> man, you know what? You are wasted sitting by that fucking pool, man. You're right. I need to do something. Scotch and sunshine is sitting on my ass. Fuck that. I'm better than that. Damn skippy, homie. All that knowledge up there is withering and dying, dawg. You don't pass that shit on, it's gone, homie. I bet you know some shit. You wouldn't believe the shit I know. Yeah? You taking some scores? There was a time, that was all I did. Shit, well, you know, I could tell you some shit, too. Yeah, like what? About this city I was born and raised in. Now think about it. Yeah, do that, man. This could be cool. Hey, thanks for the help out there today, kid. I had no idea it was gonna get that hot. Shit, pulling houses off the hillside sure has a weird way of fucking with people. Yeah, well, I thought I was through with all that shit. I don't know what the hell's going on. Oh, shit, I think we're about to find out. Do you know who I am? Do you know who I am? Do you? No. Do you? You? I think so. Good. I know who you are. I know where you live. Who are you? I'm Franklin. License. Now, Franklin. Maybe help Mr. DeSanta here. Who am I? I think Martin Madrazo. Good boy. Now maybe give him a little of a background. Man, Mr. Madrazo. It, Mr. Madrazo is a legitimate businessman who was wrongfully accused of running a Mexican-American gang and a narcotic ring, but the charges were dropped because of the witnesses came up missing. Smart kid. Now, Michael, I've got a question for you. What did you pull an architectural, significant, modernist, wonder home down the hillside in Vinewood Hills? I thought the owner was banging my wife. Well, that was a strange house for a tennis coach. <sighs> I was thinking straight. Mm, clearly. Yeah. Uh. Well, Natalia will need a hotel while you finance the rebuilds, won't she? Sure. Good. And I'm guessing here that the rebuild uh, will be somewhere in the 2.5 million range. <laughs> Of course. Great. That's nice. Come on, man. Damn, you all right? Never better. So what now? Looks like I'm gonna have to postpone my retirement. Fuck. Ah, oh, man, I'm mortgaged up to my eyeballs. Look, I only know one way to make money. I'm gonna have to give an old friend a call. Lester. I think he's in town somewhere. I'm gonna have to track him down. Just give me a little alone time, all right? All right, dog. Is this still the number for Lester Crest? Who's asking? Who's asking? Who's asking? You're awful cagey. <laughs> <clears throat> Even for a dead man, Michael. Ooh, you don't sound good, buddy. <laughs> Tactful and charming, even in death. Hey, come see me, old friend. I'm living in Los Santos, just like you. Marietta Heights. Whoa, whoa, wait. Hey, how do you... Hello? You fucker. Doc, hey. 
Michael, I'm looking through my appointment book, and I don't see your name. Yeah, well, I'm more of a walk-in guy, Doc. You know that. Walk-ins are more expensive, but I'm always happy to accommodate. Sure, you'll accommodate me as long as I got money in my pocket, right? Hey, I'm in a bad way, Doc. I might come by soon. Thank you, Lester. You gonna let me in or what? Give me a minute. I was wondering when you'd show up. I was dead. Praise be. Guess you weren't very dead. You need my help. How do you know? Because you came here. Why else would you? <clears throat> I haven't been a good friend for you, Lester. I know that. And you're gonna make it up to me by doing whatever I ask. Or rather, I, I mean... I need something done, you need to know something, so... Why not help each other? I gotta make some dough. So you're back in the game? I guess. Look, Lester, about what happened before. I know you never mentioned my name. I know I'm not on any lists anywhere. I know you never betrayed me. As for you, you gotta figure that I never told anyone that instead of gently decomposing in North Yankton, you're angrily decomposing in Los Santos with a shrink and a wife who don't love you no more. Yeah, yeah well, <laughs> since you put it like that. Hey, shut up a minute. I'm getting an eye find alert. That little college boy sack of shit, phony fuck. Who, Jay Norris? Yes, that fuck is a lying bastard. I've read his fucking emails, he's a fucking cheat. I heard him say that he saved America. What, by but... outsourcing all the jobs? By selling us little bits of plastic restricted access shit? Well, now it's payback time, you lying turd. What the hell are you talking about? You are about to get that white collar gig that you always dreamed of, Mikey. Here, take this uh, fashionably retro weird for a 45 year old man, but I cannot let go of the 1980s bag and dress yourself up like a billionaire math genius with low-level Asperger's. You better be ready for the minor glitch of your repulsive pseudo-messianic life. Okay, Lester. Get out of here! Call me when you're ready. We are about to put the Darwinism back in social Darwinism, and brother, it is gonna be fun. You fucking kidding me? I'm a bank robber, not a web designer. So we'll go robbing soon. I'll find something, just like the old days. <coughs> Was there something else? Ah, excuse me. I got this interview at this tech company. I'm thinking I need something, I don't know, geeky, youthful. Lost your job and the world's moved on, huh? That's too bad. I didn't lose my job. Of course. Got too old, got outsourced. Same thing happened to my dad. Now you gotta fit in with a different generation. Hmm? What about a vest and some cargo shorts? All right. Yup, that's as youthful as you're gonna get. Hello. Dignity aside, I think that might just work. Good luck at the interview. Goodbye. Michael? I'm all dressed up. Now, you want to run me through this thing? 
The prototype is somewhere in the Life Invader office. Find it and fit it with the device in your bag. They just gonna let me in? Why wouldn't they if you looked the part? Hang around till someone opens the door and act entitled. Fine. Hey. Hey. Uh, oh, great. Uh, PM's pushing for more functionality. <laughs> but we are maxed. I mean, if anything, we have to strip features, especially if we plan on releasing a fully yeah. priced update a year later. Oh, my. You know, it's... Yeah, well, you know, you gotta do what you gotta do, you know? I mean, we're talking beta in Q4, maybe Q3. Look, milestones are one thing, but when design is changing its mind yeah. seemingly overnight, there's not much you can do about it. You Look, know what I'm saying? Uh, my union allocated smoke bricks bowed up, so... Wait a minute. Do I know you? Yeah, I think so. I... I T-temp, right? Yeah. You know, you gotta do something for me. Ah, uh, you gotta put it in a ticket. Uh, no. I'd like to keep this one out of the database, if you know what I mean. I'm turning consultant when we release. Consulting consulters. Hi. Oh, hi. Chill out on the beanbag. Marcus will be right out. Oh, um, I'm gonna take a normal chair. I have a terrible back. Really? The brief was for a relaxed, creative individual, the kind that preferred a beanbag over a real chair, but if you're so bound to social restraints... No, 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 I'm not restrained at all. I'll... I'll, I'll, I'll take a seat. See? Mm. You're relaxed already. Let the creative juices flow. Kaboom! You just got pwned, my friend. Here you go. If you guys let me use the OS I requested, this wouldn't be a problem. This is a filthy hard drive, bro. Uh, got any antivirus software? I think so. Behind this junk on the left. Clicked an NSFW link, bro. Bit me on the ass. Yeah, not safe for work, huh? You know, my son's computer runs into the same kind of problems. I'll close the pop-ups, see what I can do. Your son codes? Start him early, bro. You write your best stuff in your tweens. After that, it's just a hack job. You want a massage? Cause my hands are free. <laughs> Bear with me, all right? My glitch fixing is gonna be way down today. <laughs> and now we scan. There it goes. Ugh, I need to write some product, Brohim. I'm feeling the itch. And that should do it. Why don't you try and keep things strictly safe for work from now on? Hey, have you seen the prototype in the demo room? When Norris announces it at the keynote, minds are gonna blow. Yes, they are. Send me the Making history, dude. Hey, and we couldn't do it without the little guys. Bye now. Oh, 
Sit, 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 sit. Quick bang, dig fast. Ow! Come on, you're gonna have to learn the foot bag if you want to get a job here, okay? Follow me. Okay. Oh. How's your air guitar? Oh, um... All right, follow me. Okay. Some a-hole drank my effing head milk! There was a totally non-passive-aggressive note on it! Let me get the door for you. Lester, the thing's in the prototype. I'm going home to watch the keynote. Teabag time, my friend! Lester, did you hear me? Are you playing that game? Yeah, yeah, sorry, the phone is rigged. Now, what's your problem? You don't like shooters? They're all the same. Besides, you know me. I'm a movie guy. Classic Vinewood. Classic Vinewood ended 30 years ago. Now it's just superheroes, romantic comedies, and remakes, none of which interest me. Hey. I believe this country can still make interesting movies. There's no better way to define American life than a two-hour plot in which the hero looks good and defeats evil. Now, whatever you say, enjoy yesterday. Anyway, just call the device after he's unveiled it, and then we'll talk. has come a long way since we started it. Parents' pool house in East Carraway. Today, you're about to witness a new phase. Full-on, weapons-grade, red alert, world domination. We have put a billion people's private data in the public domain, and we have milked every penny we could in the process. And we have one of the youngest workforces in the world. An average age of only 14.4 years? That's not just impressive, it's revolutionary! Today, right here, we are about to make the next step. Prepare to witness the future. The Life Invader mobile device. Yes, we've invented something no one else has ever thought of. A small, personal, computerized device. Now you're going to be able to stay docked 24 seven. On the bus, you can dock. On the subway, stay docked. You can be docked at home. And at the same time, you're docking with some kids at the public pool. We went to the guys at Fruit Computers and we told them we wanted to make our hardware as compatible as possible. But you know what? They're not interested in sharing their technology. So we went and made it compatible anyway. Now you can dock your Life Invader to an iFood phone or any other device. And it'll take all the data off it and reformat it into Life Invader friendly information. At around this point in my presentation, there was meant to be a call for my product team to introduce the device. Oh, huh. hold on a Fuck second. You. I think someone's trying to talk with me. Hello? 
Oh! Get security! Oh, Jesus! Whoa! No, 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 Let's... No, no. Whoa! Watching the news? I don't have to. I'm watching the markets. I'll be trading pure alpha till close. All right. Hey, about that other thing. You know the score? Oh, yeah, yeah, absolutely. Let's do it. Put on a suit, look somewhat professional, and meet me at my warehouse off the LS freeway. Oh, uh, and I'm about to email you a link for the exchange. You can put in some trades of your own. Uh, I'm trying to stay off the day trading. Uh, but maybe I'll take a look. your linear entertainment. Go watch porn. Just go away. Shit. Fuck you! What the fuck? You disrespectful little asshole! I can't believe you did that! That's my TV! You don't talk to me like that! I can't believe you... Mom was right about you. You don't know any better and you can't help it, but you're an asshole! Yeah, well, why don't you do something then? Besides just stand there. Why don't you hit me? Is that what you want? To be hit by your son? Yeah! No! I just... Want you to do something besides sit there eating? Yeah, great. Thanks for the fucking guidance, Dad. It means a lot. Wait. I'm just trying to help you. Yeah. Well, nothing says I love you like smashing my fucking TV. Nothing at all. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just wish we could do things together. Hey, what things? I don't know. Uh, go for walks. Play ball. You know I have bad glands. Yeah. Bike ride, then. Bike ride? You want to go on a fucking bike ride? Fine, fine, let's go on a fucking bike ride. Fuck me. A bike ride along the Spucci Beach? Okay, Dad. I got just the thing to show you. This day was going so well until you showed up. You know that? Ugh! Yo, you're lucky to even be allowed out of the house after that boat stuck. What's the big deal? If anything goes wrong, you can just fake your death and start all over. How am I meant to develop my own moral sensibilities when yours are so unbelievably fuck-based? Don't push me. Seriously, some guys borrow your bow. Borrow? You were hiding in the head crying kidnap. They just took receipt of your property with payment pending. If it was anything other than what you told me, then that's on you. All right, they fucking stole it. And who knows what they would have done if they found me. But I didn't expect or want them to get killed. You think I'm gonna let some guys ride off with my son? Look, I knew you were a bad guy, but... Oh, a bad guy. A crook, a killer, a thief, a liar. I guess I've been all those things one time or another, right? It's just... What? I always thought I was the good guy. God help the morally bankrupt planet your generation have left us if you're the good guy. Yeah. Anyway... I always knew you were the kind of person who didn't let other people get in the way, but... 
I hadn't, like, seen that happen before. Yeah, well, that's me, Jim. And I've been trying my best to get things under control for the last ten years. But that was an extreme fucking situation, and I had to act. A normal person wouldn't have done that. Yeah, well, I had to. To protect you. Yeah, keep telling yourself that when you see their faces every time you close your eyes. Yeah, what's cracking? Here we are, the bike rental place. Please don't shoot the bike rental guy out of, like, force of habit. Hey, you! Two bikes. Take your pick. I want to come home. Los Santos is a shitty city. Yo, thanks. This one will do. If I make it to the end of the pier first, you're going to buy me a big-ass new flat screen. End of the pier, fine. But if you lose, you're gonna do something with your life. Hey, Pop, if you're such a health nut, we should do a triathlon or some other midlife crisis nonsense. If I have a heart attack, it's your fault. Now, let me think. What am I gonna do with all that spare TV money? <sighs> Lie down, old man. It's not the winning, James. It's the taking part that counts. <laughs> oh, I'm about to pass out. When I wake up, please let this nightmare be over. You killed my best friend, you bastard. This is for him. I'm real. I never bike with the man who marked my flash screen. Don't give up, even though you're losing. You're buying your own TV. You know, this is real nice, Dad. Bonding, good times. Yeah, yeah, I'm giving it my best shot. Come on, we're having fun, right? You wouldn't know fun if it sat on your face. Ah, come on. I mean, why do I have to hold your hand through this whole midlife crisis bullshit? And why don't you stick your nose up Tracy's butt sometime? Because Tracy doesn't buy cars she can't afford so that thugs break in our house. Tracy doesn't get kidnapped or destroy my yacht. Well, that's just because she's too busy getting fucked by dudes to get on TV. You don't talk about your sister that way. Well, I'm sorry, but it's true. I mean, according to her Life Invader page, she's hanging out with producers and porno guys this afternoon. What are you talking about? Actually, it's all happening right out there. What? That boat that makes yours look like a refugee raft? You know the kind of boat, the one that makes a young, impressionable girl drop her pants and spread her legs. This is the reason you brought me here, isn't it? You fuck. Ah! Dad, wait! Dad, come on now.
Hey, man, whoa, whoa, whoa. Plus, we're taking you out of here. Dad, you're embarrassing me. These are my friends. Yeah, you're embarrassing her, dude. They're shooting porno here. They shoot porno all over town. Mom rented our house to them last summer. That was what? Our house? Yeah. Man, you got a killer pad, man. <laughs> Isn't it awesome? Let's go. <laughs> Those walls can talk. You think I do it? Hey. No. Hey. Shit, hey, Daddy. cool, man. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? Oh, oh, hey. Oh, 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 man. Come. I like that. What's the problem? You're such a oh. jerk. Come on. Dad, you dumbass. These guys are serious. Yeah, well, so am I. Go to the scene of my fucking boat. Oh, motherfuckers. Get on! Now! I'm about to skin you alive! God damn it! Go! Shit! They're coming after us! Go into that outlet! F off or my dad will like cap one of your asses! Oh my god! Did you just kill him? Maybe he's just injured. Keep going this way. You killed them! Oh my god, this isn't happening! Just calm down. I did what I had to do. Let me take you back to your brother. I'm an accessory to murder! No, you're not. You're an accessory to self-defense. Have I, like, got to be a witness because I... I, like, did some blow. You did blow? Yeah, I did some blow, and that might, like, make my testimony inadmissible. You're not admissing anything. There won't be a trial unless you're on a trial for doing blow. After you ruined my day, stole my friend's shit, capped them, and I'm the one on trial? They started it. And we wouldn't be in this mess if you hadn't hung out with some creepy-ass portal people and done blow. You didn't know I did blow until I told you I did blow. So this should be like an increase in trust and honesty thing. And porno dudes are like the best dudes I can be with. Porno dudes? Really? Yeah, they actually respect women and treat us right. It's Los Santos, Dad. What do you expect when he moves here? Enough! This conversation is over. Keep hiding your head in the clouds. The 50s are over. Even the 80s are over. See? That's the problem, because they're not over in my head. Well, grow up! my TV and he took me to the beach. The beach with my skin. So what, you send him out to spoil my day too? I didn't know that he was gonna come get you. I just told him where you were. You know, he got that crazy look in his eyes, you know, like he gets sometimes and he just went. I'm getting a cab. I'm coming with you. How about I just drive us home? You ruined my life. Downturn's really getting to me, you know? I know what you're saying. <laughs> yeah, who's this? It's Ricky from Life Invader. I know you're the bro who deactivated Jay, bro. <laughs> oh, I have no idea what you're talking about, pal. Hello, what yeah. you do's your business, bro. Anyway. Jay really got a big head once people started calling him a god. Guess you proved he wasn't one. They reintegrated my team in Burundi after the design got signed off. And now, my shares ain't worth dick. Sorry about that. I need work, and I thought maybe you could provide. I mean, I'm smart enough to track you down, aren't I? I guess you are. 
Hey, I'll be in touch if anything comes up. Come in, Michael. Uh, yeah, thanks, Doc. How have you been? Oh, good. Things been good. No, actually, things ain't been good. Things been a far fucking way from good. I've been uh, acting out. That's what you would call it, I think, right? Acting out. So what exactly has been the problem? I'm not good, Doc. Not good at all. I'm sorry to hear that. Tell me. I just... I've been caught up in the bullshit, Doc. You know, ever since I pulled this Mexican's house off a hill, it's been nothing but killing and robbing. I mean, I hooked up with this old associate. I even got a new one, too, this kid. With, I don't know, he's got similar proclivities. Uh, you know? Oh, God. Now everything's out of control. I mean, and if it's not by choice, you know, I just... My life just got away from me. That sounds a lot like denial, Michael. This is really worrying. So, any other violent urges, friend? Things have really been up and down, Doc. I mean, one minute I'm fine, the next the fucking red mist descends. I can't seem to help myself. These are the classic symptoms of your condition, Michael. You're very ill. I really just want to be happy, Doc. Is that so bad? Okay. And what about your sexual behaviors? I've been a really good boy, Doc. Really good. Not one problem. I'm glad to hear that. Really glad. Keep working it. This is great. I just ain't myself right now, Doc. Not since my life went crazy. You're plainly addicted to chaos. Well, I'm not sure that's true, Doc. <laughs> I'm not exactly enjoying myself here. Now, what I'm addicted to is not getting killed. But for some reason, I keep getting my ass into situations where getting killed is a little hard to avoid. What about the people you kill? Well, yeah, but that's not for fun. Are you sure? What exactly are you asking, Doc? Am I a psychopath who enjoys suffering? Or a sociopath who doesn't give a flying fuck about the rules? Come on, we've already had this conversation, right? I'm neither. I'm just a fat, washed-up jock who can't get his head around the fact that his high school football career didn't play out the way that he planned. The only way I'm content and, and competent is with a gun in my hand or a price on my head. You're very defensive, Michael. Do you consider yourself a failure? I pay you to listen to my problems. I'm rich, I'm miserable. I mean, half the time my kids can't stand me, the other half my wife is cheating on me. I kill people without remorse, Doc. Hell, I'm pretty average for this town, really. Wait a minute, that's the shot. I, I, I think I'm having a breakthrough here, Doc. This, I think, no, no, I know that I'm just terrified that I'm I'm sure gonna... you are, but. That's really all we have time for. See you next time. Okay. I'm 
drunk. But shit, I ain't getting drunker. Don't wanna know. Franklin! What the fuck? <clears throat> I mean, what the hell going on here? Wait a minute, Franklin, what are you doing here? I live here. This half my house, too. So you say? Anyway, Magenta is reinvigorating my femininity. So make yourself scarce, boy. Go. Go. With pleasure. Go. Goodness. And stay out of trouble. Love. Yeah, yeah. Love. Bitch, you ain't no more of a man than me. I hear that. Gangsta shit, nigga. Look who's bizarre. What's up, fool? with it, man? Oh, no, no. Show some respect here, nigga. That man, they couldn't hold down his back. Come on now. Damn, man. I gotta spend my day with another middle-aged fool trying to recapture his youth. What this fool just say? I missed you, dawg. Oh, oh. You missed me, huh? Nah, I ain't missed you. Your ass could've stayed gone for good. So I fucked your girl, mm -hmm. mugged your mom, mm. and better yet, I ain't thought about your ass in years. Ha, ha. You got jokes now, huh? Hey, but I see you doing well for yourself. Check that on out. Shit, I'm doing just fine. That's what I hear. But I know some sweet boys up in the pen that got bigger balls than you. Oh, you been doing your time looking at sweet boy balls? Uh -huh. Yeah, it's good to have confirmation. This funny fuck. Why you keep hanging around this clown, L? Shake this fool, we man. We from the same set, Stretch. Why, why y'all niggas can't get along? Y'all been doing this shit for years, man. You know what, dawg? It's good you back home. Glad you here. Missed you, boy. Damn, you definitely got hit up inside. Hit up? Hey, hey. Yo, motherfucker, I know little niggas like you been turned out on the daily. Talking about being hit up, nigga, I swear, man. You ain't got no motherfucking respect. Motherfucker, I got respect for reality. Reality? All right. All right, you keep thinking that. Just keep thinking that, nigga. Shit, you gonna get yours. Fuck you. Uh, I swear, man. Strizzettes, come whoa, on, whoa, man. Whoa, cool out. Fuck, Chill, man. man. This motherfucker get on my goddamn nerves. The nigga get on my nerves, too, man. Part of the nigga charm, man. F, come on, man. Let's just bust a move, man. You gonna drive or what, Bill? Drive where? Pick up this heat, nigga. Why? Business, nigga. Real business. Come on, bro. Y'all niggas act like girls. Shit. Not me. Shit. Ammunition, come on. Let's go. Shit, homie, you gonna drop all that bread on that gear, you might as well get a haircut, too. Fucking crazy-haired microphone, motherfucker. I got a microphone I can shove right in your prison pocket. Nigga, you walk like you keister and shit anyway. You know, when I went away, you punks was little homies, and I was a big homie. Now I'm out, and you little homies is big homies. But you still gotta respect. Man, what the fuck this nigga talking about? We all big homies, but he bigger, right? Exactly. Man, that's some fucking pyramid scheme bullshit. Pyramids is good, man. Illuminati Pharaoh shit. Soon as we get this shit, as soon as we get paid, homie. Soon as we get incarcerated, more likely. Ammunition. Armorer to the stars. Hey, what's up, man? Firing range is in the back. And all our weapons are customizable. Oh, hell yeah. You can trick your blam blam out up in here. Quit all that. Just straight up artillery, man, all right? Don't y'all shut the fuck up. I got this, you clowns. All right, homie, get your shotgun with the flashlight modification. Why the fuck am I the only one buying this? Because we got sheets, homie. Now shut the fuck up and come on. Now, just let me reinstate, man, that the purchases made by this man ain't got nothing to do with the two gentlemen of fella nature. That's right. Yeah. Now, let's go bust on some niggas.
Take us down to that one spot where the base heads be taking their cans at. You know, on Fringe in La Puerta. The bullets just bounce off. Come back soon. Check that shit! Got some cans or some shit I don't know about? Nah, homie. We got ourselves a drug deal. Why do I get the feeling it's gonna be one of them deals gone wrong type situations? Now, see, that's that negative attitude Lamar was telling me about, nigga. You ain't getting nowhere thinking like that. The power of positive bullshit. You ought to be clenching your motherfucking vagina muscles with my aunt, nigga. After his bed, it probably need tightening up. This ain't new age shit. It's fact. You get what you get, fool. You been getting dick, but you ain't giving it, huh? Some Mark talk like that to an OG? <laughs> CGF has changed, man. No wonder the hood is so lame right now. Speaking of change, Lamar's been meaning to talk to you, homie. Nah, nah, not now, homie. What's happening? It's nothing, my nigga, nothing, you know? Just some ideas, that's all. Man, ideas ain't your strong suit, so put it on me. It's nothing real, homie. When it's something real, we'll talk. Bullshit, man. It's realer than this crap. Hey, we meeting them here. Man, how'd you find this place? The homie set it up. This the kind of spot where we ain't gonna be disturbed. That's what the fuck worries me. I'm more of a hide in the plain sight type of nigga. No, you more of a punk bitch type nigga. <laughs> What's, What's up, up fool? fool? What up, we it? got that shit, nigga. With a paper hat, nigga. I'm talking about Buku bills. More Davis. <laughs> What's up, boy? Everything cool? Yeah. Hold on, man. What the fuck, man? You was just kidnapping this nigga. Oh, oh come, come on, on dog. Now, don't real man. recognize real. D, my nigga, just got out crossing lines, did some time with some of your folks. Hey, look, look, look. This ain't about you, man. What? You know these niggas dumb. Yo, what fuck, the fuck duh? this trick talking about, man? Yeah, What's yeah, that? yeah, yeah, yeah. Somebody I see, see. On us? They put a nigga on TV, man, about some gang intervention shit. Hey, this ain't the police, dog. This some ballers bullshit. Nigga, that's some man. bullshit. Fuck, fuck, you. What's up with hey, we been set up, nigga. This shit fucked fuck up. Fuck you, nigga. You. Fuck, 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 shit. Oh, bitch ass ballers. Oh, we doing this or what? Boy. Come on. Oh. Ah, Yo, we close. Oh, you see that shit? Man, you make a punk look like a G. Fuck. Oh, fuck. fuck! I said lay low after you got caught. You lay low, motherfucker. That ain't me. I can see that. You always say you knew better, bitch, but you always end up in the same fucked up situations. I'm gonna learn to trust my own motherfucking instincts. Fuck! Man, I deserve to get booked. Dumbass baby G! You going first next time, no fool. Oh, girl, huh? Shit, nigga, didn't we all be dead? Oh. Not me, nigga. You about to have a bunch of dead homies. You ain't creeping on us. Man, I ain't going down. Come on, little homies. Let's do this. Enough with all that shit. We on our way. Man, I don't want your clumsy ass falling down these stairs, fool. They was a safety hazard before blood got spilled all over the place. This shit is over, homie. Uh, ah, never homie. fucking learn. Man, y'all better get caught. Send him back! Uh, ah, dead, you motherfucker! Man, clap these fools! I'ma follow you for a minute! Whoa. We ain't gonna run! Ah. Fuck that! Get out! Oh. Here! Oh. Again! Bang this motherfucker! Man, man bullshit! Keep your head down! Fool! Oh, fuck you! That shit. 
shit. We all gonna pop all these dudes. Did you think to work out an action while you set up this meet? There's always a way out, motherfucker. We gonna find it. You see that shit? It's on fire, man. All right, we gotta go then. Get out, fool. What kind of dumb motherfucker would trust that motherfucker? Uh, it look good on paper, is all I'm gonna say. They got my number, man. Go ahead. Fuck. Cops outside. I ain't going back. There's a fire door. These motherfuckers on the sky, dog. Ah. We ain't going nowhere with that chopper on us. Take it out. Hey, it's a back over here. I wasn't here. I wasn't even in this state. <laughs> That's it. That's it. We lost him. Now take us somewhere where we can get it in, homie. Oh, man. We going back to my crib, man, and you can walk from there. Hey, what the hell you walked me into back there? Shit, man, you're the one popped his ass. I did the necessary. Yeah, thank you for that, dawg. This all on you, LD, lanky dumbass. Me? Hey, I ain't know the fools was gonna roll on us. If you started something with the ballers, shit, I don't care if you CGF for life, man. You done. Done, you dig? Actually, we ain't CGF for life, because all that means is we giving you money for nothing. We got our own shit now, homie. Foreign gangsters. Oh, no, nah, no, nah, he don't mean that, low. F just talking outside his neck. I'm gonna reach cross lines, all right? Conversate with the purple homies. Yeah, yeah, that's a good idea, man. Smart shit. But if I gotta hang you assholes out for this, the game comes first. Oh, it ain't gonna come to that, homie. You all diplomatic and shit. Yeah, he a real fucking diplomat, ain't he? This that peace talking motherfucker we should have sent to the Middle East. Fuck, Fuck me. No wonder I wanna get out of here. No one's stopping you, little homie. Here we are, man. You gonna hang with your auntie while the men break it off. Shut the fuck up. Hell no, nah, nigga. You sounding more and more like a snee eye yitch every day. Hell no, nah, yeah. nigga. I sound like somebody trying to make some paper and not get killed. He's a hook ass nigga, I told nigga, you. Nigga, go toss a salad, stretch mark ass bitch.
train. Oh, you don't have to call to tell me that. Not you. The Dieter Sachs door detective. There's been a misunderstanding. I need you to help clear it up. Yeah, but see, if I help you out, you're never gonna learn. Screw you, Michael! The lawyer's fees are coming out of your account! Keep cool, old baby! It's just a call! the hell is this place? Garment factory. I needed a job that didn't require me to do anything apart from uh, paying taxes. Okay, listen. What do you got? The Holy Grail. The Union Depository. And they say it cannot be hit. Hasn't been yet. Look, I just owe some Mexican hood a couple million bucks because I wrecked his girlfriend's house. I don't need to go crazy here. Which Mexican? Martin Madrazo. He's not supposed to be very nice. Oh, when I met him, he was charming. <laughs> so what do you think? Oh, um, let's see. Either we hit a bank in the sticks or we do a store. Which do you like? Well, <clears throat> store's usually easier. But I gotta make a big take. Oh, well, gems it is, then. Let's go to Vangelico, buy ourselves an engagement ring. Oh, we're gonna need a crew. I can round up some of the old guys. There are no old guys. Moses, uh, ironically, he found Jesus. Uh, all those Irish crazies, they mostly just disappeared. That crew from the south, they all went down. There was uh, an Eastern European guy making moves in Liberty City, but uh, yeah, he went quiet. All right. Well, we're gonna need a crew. You got any contacts in LS or not? I've been working with someone, but they're too unpredictable. I'll have to reach out to some other guys. We're going to Little Portola. Your FIB buddies, they uh, know you're back in business. FIB buddies? What are you talking about? I checked out the WPP thing. Doesn't look like any WITSEC program I'm aware of. But for starters, they, uh, they don't put witnesses up in multi-million dollar mansions in Rockford Hills. No, maybe they thought this would be the best cover. And most witnesses don't transfer five-figure sums into a particular FIB agent's bank account every month. Of course, the money gets moved around and washed through a number of fronts, but the trail is there. Deposits and withdrawals, the same sum every month. Agent Dave Norton, white middle-aged divorcee, unremarkable career, except for one incident, the shooting of a notorious stick-up man, Michael Town. Yeah, 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 all right. Lester, I'm very impressed. Look, uh, we can talk about this another time. Uh, take these glasses. My eyesight's fine. They're fitted with a camera and a radio relay. I'm gonna run the operation from the car while you're in the store getting what we need. Okay, let's get this done. I beg your How pardon. Are you doing? Oh, okay. And in the clouds again. You're reading me? Mm hmm. Okay, we need shots of the security features the alarm system, ventilation, cameras. No. Last I checked, we were casing Vangelico. Get in there. Sir, thank you. The alarm keypad is on the left when you come in, uh, on the wall by the side door. Glasses are live, shoot away. Ah, okay, that's their alarm. Uh, can you get me an air vent in one of the cameras? Hey, beautiful. I need to pick up a little something for the woman in my life. 
but one of them. <laughs> Sir, I'm sure we can help you. Tell me about her. What's her taste? Cheap. Thank God. The same my wife we're talking about. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to spend too much. I'm thinking maybe... 10 grand? Our rings start at 8. Our pendants start at 12. All right. So these things built to last, or am I just paying for the Vangelical logo here? <laughs> no, 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 no. We use perfect clarity jewels. 18 karat gold, 950 platinum. Nothing but the best. All right. I think you just made a sale. I'm going to take a look around, think about it, come back to you, baby. Don't go anywhere. I understand. Okay. Thank you, sir. You got it. Fine. That was what it was, but you're not done taking photographs. My checklist reads ventilation system and CCTV. Great. You got the security camera and the ventilation in that shot. Come back to me. So, we good? Almost. I need to get eyes on the roof of the building. See where the ventilation comes out. Drive us around the block. We gotta find a way up to the roof. Look, there. Some construction. Yeah, if they're gutting the place, I might be able to get to the roof. So, you keep up with the old crew? I saw a ladder. Climb up it and see if you can get to the roof. You know, after your death slash disappearance, there wasn't much holding us together. Yeah. You see him at all? After the incident? I kept tabs on him for a while. Needed to, uh, know that he didn't blame me. Yeah, where'd he go? North, south, east, west, wherever there were liquor stores to turn over and hitchhikers to disappear. Where did they bury him? They buried him? Not as far as I know. He's probably a John Doe then, right? I'm on the roof! I need to know where the air coming out of those vents in Vangelico originates. There should be a unit above the store. Uh. What do you think? OD? Shootout? Maybe just a car crash, right? Anonymous charred remains on the highway? They only knew what a sick puppy they had on their hands. Hey, I see the vents. Yeah, I'm looking at the relay. Can you get any higher? You've got a good vantage. Now use it and get an image of the air system. Okay, capture an image of the system and we're done. We've got our shot of the Vangelico unit. Looks good. Okay, that will do. Now come back to me before uh, someone spots you up there. Will do. Here, take your glasses back. Let's go back to the garment factory. I called ahead and told him to start setting up the information. So, what did you see? Uh, nothing that'll cause undue complications. Yeah, it looked like a simple setup. Cameras broadcasting to a remote server. Who might be able to wipe? Security guard on the door. He won't want to die for rich assholes to rub his nose in it. Uh, good. Alarm system's linked to the door lock. We'll get a good window if someone talented hacks it. Anything else? Well, the uh, more valuable merchandise is in the cabinets in the center of the store, by the register. So I'd start there. Mm, glass in the cabinets wasn't bulletproof. Means you could smash them easy enough, but the stones will be in the safe at night. So, we go in when it's open then. Right. Once we melt down the gold, recut the rocks, that's an okay score. Yeah, shame we can't go in after hours, man. Those vents look promising. 
I might be able to flip that another way. I'm listening. Wait till we get back. About the crew. Yeah? There's this kid who's been helping me. Maybe we could cut him in. I don't work with amateurs. He ain't an amateur. Or if he is, he's a gifted amateur about to turn pro. He's a good kid, Lester. You know what they say. It's your funeral. One of them, at least. Ha <laughs> ha Workers have their uses. Okay, let me set this up. <laughs> nice to see the methods haven't changed. Well, we gotta figure out what we're doing somehow. All the crews, the rolls, prep work. Don't wanna leave evidence behind on a hard drive. So yeah, the uh, methods don't change. Right, not for a pro. <laughs> well, mapping out the options. I'm showing you all the angles, that's my area of professional expertise. But making decisions, that is your domain, my friend. Here. Now, there's two ways I see of doing this. We go in smart, or we go in loud and dumb. Remember the vents? If we're gonna be smart, we pump a little knockout gas through the air system, then hit the cabinets while everyone's out. You'll have to source the gas, of course, but crowd control won't slow you down, and that might improve the take. The cover is pest control, so no one will look twice when you're wearing gas masks. It means getting a pest control van, though. You go in dumb, and you'll need your, uh, famous way with people and four carbine rifles. But we can't buy them and risk them getting traced. No, 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 we've got to find some in circulation. It's awkward, it's, uh, <laughs> real awkward, but this is the gun favored by LS. PD tactical team, so one of their vans is probably a good place to look. A hacker can disable the cameras. The length of time depends on their ability. The alarm will be operating on the same window. The exit strategy is more or less the same for both options. The driver you pick will, of course, source some bikes. You come out of the store and make your way through the new subway tunnel they're digging off the Del Perro freeway. You lose the cops in there and meet a truck in the LS River. All right, I want my guy Franklin on the getaway. He can handle a bike. All right, if you vouch for him, I'll take the risk. So how do you want to do this? Run in through the front door or try to play it smart? Ah, you've grown wise and cautious in your old age. Okay. Select personnel with that in mind. As ever, the better they are, the bigger the cut. Now the driver, they'll source the bikes, lead you out through the tunnels. Ah, okay. This one's new blood. I've seen him drive, but I haven't seen him under pressure. Guns. Now we're hoping to keep quiet, so this guy shouldn't make much difference. Ah, Norm. Came across as uh, a bit of an idiot, but could be useful. Hacker. Back office, but this is the person who will determine how long you get inside. This guy, Ricky. I met him at the Life Invader office. He may not be that good, but he's enthusiastic. Let's take a chance on him. That look good to you? Are you sure? Great. Uh, I'll do some research on a pest control van and the knockout gas, and I'll be in touch. Oh, yes. Huh? Good, good. I'll call you when everything's ready. You'll need to pitch it to the guys. Whoa, what? My rep don't count for nothing no more? You're a dead man, Michael. I'll call you. 